20 hours on the road. Welcome to my arcade. Oh yeah. Check it out. You got the kitchen. Table. Little living room right here. Big old TV. Go down the hallway. Big man in the bathroom. There I am. What to do? Bedroom number one. And here's my bedroom right here. You already know I'm sleeping on that top, top bunk, of course. Yep. Just like that, man. We are finally here. After 20 hours on the road in Clearwater. And we're about to go do some fishing. Nice place right here. How do, you, how do you like the place, man? I love it, man. It's nice. Nice? It's rent free, too. <laughs> yep, rent free. Let's get, on, my let's get a look at the patio, patio really quick. The aunt and uncle right here. Yeah, I would, I would never. I would never. Just documenting. <laughs> How'd you guys make up? So yeah, that's where we're gonna be staying for the next couple of days. So we're gonna be doing a lot of fishing. Hopefully we can at least catch some fish, man. Never fished in the ocean or salt water before. So we're gonna head out there right now and see what we can catch. Guys, first Florida fish I got on right here. I have no idea what it is. Oh, it's fighting pretty good though. I can tell it's small though. Oh, oh wow. I think that's a sheep's head, or I don't know what this is. Oh, Oh snap. Alright. First Florida fish. No idea what it is, but first ever Florida yeah, fish. Yeah, first ever Florida fish. I don't know what this is guys. Oh look at a nice color out there. It's like blue and yellow. Looks sweet, but we're gonna let him go. Uh -oh, that, I don't know if you've seen that bird, but he was looking for it right there. So let's get back out there. That one just caught on this little rig I always use this in uh, New York fishing the river just a little drop shot got a little weight down to a little hook and I put the bead on there for some color so I'll throw in some brine shrimp and that's how we're working it today so I'll give it a couple more casts and see if we can get anything a little bigger than that nice all right guys that was a culprit right here I tried to just take that fish I caught but you can let them have it. We don't feed, feed the wildlife out here. But there was a couple birds down this way. I don't know where they went, but I had a piece of shrimp on the ground and came right up behind me and stole it. But yeah, this is where we're fishing right here, under the giant bridge. I threw it way out there because I see the current ripping. And I figured fish would like to hide in the current. So that's where I caught them right there. Comment below if you know what type of fish that was because I had no idea. Hopefully we can catch some different species and uh, maybe a little bigger fish, if nothing. We'll head to the ocean side because this is the inlet side and see if we can catch any bigger fish out there. Alright, what's going on guys? Spot number two for the day. Just took a little rest after that first spot. We are getting tons of little nibbles but figured there were some small fish so we uh, moved to this, uh, it's called the Clearwater Pass. It's uh, right where the inshore uh, goes to the offshore. So let me show you it right here. So that's the inlet right there. And then all the way down there at the end, that's the ocean right there. So we're not too far from the ocean, so we 
pretty much catch anything right now. Uh, maybe if uh, any of these people leave soon, maybe try out the dock because I've seen people catch a little small silverfish there. I have no idea what they are, but yeah, this is where we're fishing right now. So, uh oh, reel it in. Get a little hit. Reel. Weeds on the line. Yeah, that was hit, but you just said it was weeds, so. We're gonna see if we can pull out any here. Haven't had much luck the first day, but we'll just talk to some people and they give us some spots and some tips, so hopefully we'll get in some fish today. So get back to your feet, catch any fish. Alright, fish on guys. Oh snap. I had a fresh shrimp and a mullet head on. Oh, it's a stingray. Get down. Very nice. Oh, wait, oh snap. You got him, bud. There we go, on the shrimp. Frozen shrimp. Wow, look at that. I gotta be careful. Because I have no, no I, have to, I do not want to get barbed by this thing. Alright, let's try to lift them up. Yeah, look at that. Look at that. Ocean fish number one on the shrimp. Wow, look at that. Watch out for the tail. Man, that's crazy. Crazy. Oh, way to go, Noah. <laughs> <laughs> but they, are, they have vacuum mouths. We do all up north north fish. Yeah, they have vacuum mouths. Just don't be just too timid with it. You know what I mean? Yeah, good. Don't be scared. There you go, Noah. There you go. I'm trying to see it. There, that's it. There you yeah, go. There we go. Oh yeah. How about that? First thing right right there. There you go. It's pretty cool. I don't know what type it is though, but we're gonna throw them back. Look at them yeah, go, yeah. guys. Oh, Thank you very you much. Catch them with. What do you think, Noah? Man, I didn't expect that little stingray to fight that hard, but dude, I doing? thought I thought you had a weed on it. All of a sudden, it yeah, took off on it you. Took off straight away. I seen the I seen it the uh, rod tip bounce like this, so uh, we were using these circle hooks. So I just reeled right into it and it started running right away. And I was like, "Oh, that's a fish! I wonder what it is." So we we're just using a little mullet head right here. And then what he took was a little frozen shrimp on the bottom right here. And all we're using is our buddy, who's a charter captain. Shout out to Vince if you're out there. Exactly, Vince. He, thank you. He set us up with his. Uh, Surf fishing, surf stuff. fishing rods, and we're not on the surf right here, but we put on bigger baits to try to catch some bigger fish. So I guess it worked. It's a pretty strong fight too for that little ocean fish. So we're gonna keep on fishing and see if we can catch any more out here. Good job, Noah. Well, what's the fish? Real. The small one. Real. Keep reeling, man. Oh yeah, what is that? Dude, that's a puffer. Puffer fish. Yeah, it's a freaking puffer. On the, on the little live mullet. Holy oh, crap. No. That's a puffer fish. That's my dad's Is first. that a puffer fish? Yeah, that's a puffer fish. Oh, no. You know what, guys? We don't know how to hold or handle <laughs> any of this stuff. So, I guess we're going to take it off and... Uh, yep, take it off and we'll try to hold it up at least. So. No, I ain't even take it I don't know how to hold it. <laughs> Alright, let's get this thing up. Okay. Alright. Sweet. Puffer fish. Nice. All right, guys, let me show you how I set that one up real quick. So, we got ourselves some frozen shrimp right here. All you do is just tear off the head, throw that in the water, and then break it in half, just like that. And then we got ourselves a nice piece of uh, shrimp right here. Take the hook, thread it through. I usually like to keep the shell on because it helps keep it in place. So we got one right there. And then, oh, he caught the puffer fish on with this little finger mullet right there. So I just cut a small chunk of it off. About, about this big right here. And then put that one on the top hook. 
we got the hook right here, and then I just hooked it through, peel off the scales first. And stick it right through, so the hook's exposed just like that. So let's throw this out here. There's a fish. There's a fish. Yep. Oh. Nice. And I think this this is the same. I think this is the same type I caught my very first fish. I think this is a, called a pinfish. Wow, this has got some cool colors on it. Oh, that's a, that's a lot bigger. That's the first one you caught, but yeah, it's bigger. This is the same, look at this same one I got. Very pretty. They're so pretty. Yeah, All right, that's a sweet little fish right there. I have no idea what type it is, but I'm pretty sure this is the first fish I ever caught in salt water. Right down here, too, so let's let them go real quick. Sweet. Oh, look at that. Swam right into the rocks. That was a sweet one right there. Let's see if we can get any more like that. Whoa. Whoa. Drag. This one looks cool. Whoa, what is that? Dang, look at that. What is this thing? <laughs> Well, you're catching a plethora of all different fish today, Noah. You don't got a... Look at that right there. Well, these aren't steelhead, that's for sure. Yep. Wow. <laughs> it's a beautiful fish. Hang on, let me get the front of it. Is it in the sunlight? Good. That's no, beautiful. I got a beautiful picture. Wow, look at that. He is crazy looking. <laughs> Sweet fish right there. Looks like an angelfish. I have no idea what it is, though. That's what I'm talking about. See you later, buddy. Sweet. What fish? I think this is the same one. It's a smaller version of the same one. Sweet colors on that one. The sunlight. Nice fish. Let go. All is using. Just a little bitty, bitty little bitty thing of shrimp right here. Nice. Oh. Oh, what is that? Oh, what is that? What the heck is that? I have no idea what that one is either. Look at that. Took the shrimp too. Sweet. That fish gave a lot of pull. Seems bony. Is he bony, Noah? Yeah, look at this. Look at his tail too. I'm gonna get close on a fish and then I'll get back. Nice wow. and sunny. Is it Beautiful. nice and sunny? Oh, gorgeous. Yeah, nice and bright. Look at the front of him. Look at that fish, guys. Wow. Real bony, too. Not, it's like nothing I ever felt before. Let's throw him back. Whoa, did you see how fast he took off? Dude, he took off fast. That's crazy. Alright, new species right there for me. My dad and my aunt and uncle were saying that it might be a parrotfish, so we're gonna have to fact check them to see if they're right. That one came on a piece of squid right there. Good thing I switched to the shrimp because the shrimp was getting teared up and I was having to replace it like 24-7. So I'm probably gonna put another piece of squid on there and see if we can catch any more sweet fish like that. Yeah. Baby pop. 
puffer. Oh, look at that. Baby puffer, baby puffer dude. <laughs> Oh, wow, look at them kids, look how big up. they get. See that old light Michelle? Yeah, like yeah, pops yeah. up. Wow. They get pissed off. We're live. This is live action, man. In the sun. With my sister and brother-in-law. It's her birthday today and she doesn't want to eat the puffer fish. Look at that fish. puffer fish, man. Look at it blow up. <laughs> <laughs> Let him go. Nice. <laughs> I was recording that too on the camera. <laughs> yeah. Look at it. Oh, it's got little arms on it like this. Yeah. Look at it. This is a freaking fish. Yeah. It up with yeah, that's like something I'd want to take home and put in, put in a. Yeah. Look at that fish. What do you think, Mike? Nice, nice picture? Yeah. yeah nice but picture. What the hell is it? Take a picture of yeah, look at its little hands on it. Oh, so See that? It must crawl on the bottom or something. It's a freaking. It's a mutant from The Simpsons. <laughs> All right, guys. Crazy looking fish right there. It looks like a flying fish because it has wings on it like that, and he's got little arms to crawl. Maybe on the bottom. Let's get him back. Sweet. There he goes. Nice fish right there. That's got to be at least five different species on a day. So let's get back out there. This one. Now this one looks a little different. It's got a black spot on the tail. All right, check that one out right there. What is that? It's got a black tail. New species for me. All silver and a little bit of green on top. Let them go. Sweet one. guys but got a nice sweet ocean cash catfish right there they taste they taste really good oh yeah yeah I've, I've probably cooked about 40 of those wow all right guys like i was saying i don't know how much got on film but because the gopro might have ran out of battery but nice ocean catfish right here definitely don't want to touch this because some guy stepped on one and the spike went right through his shoe this morning there he goes, man. Straight to the depths. That one was on a chunk of squid, too. That's crazy. All right, guys. Pretty epic day so far. I know I didn't get that uh, catfish fight on tape because my GoPro ran out. So I just got the release, but at least you were able to get a nice look at it. And my dad's right here. He just went back to the car. Go with this setup right here. Another uh, pull from our friend. And he's just charters. <laughs> Right there. Noah seems to be hitting everything on this assembly. He's just throwing it way out into the channel. And then what do you got on there? Let's see. Uh, whatever you want to call it. I don't know what it's called. <laughs> Drop shot. We got the pyramid sinker. Yep. To the circle hook. And then one more circle hook up there. So we're going to put mullet on top and what on the bottom? Squid maybe? Yeah, maybe squid. Okay. Well, we'll see if we can get you any other species beside that puffer fish. Come on, guys. Puffer fish is beautiful. <laughs> I was scared to touch it. I thought it was going to poison me. <laughs> Big one. Holy smokes. Oh, we pull a drag. Yeah. Big fish, big fish. Oh, he's going. Get you, up. you got your pulling? Oh, let me get my thing out the water. Come on, keep it on, keep it on. Oh, look at 
Look at the size of that sucker, dude. Ooh, it's a big stingray, dude. Big stingray. We have to get the front of this spot. Holy smokes. It's big, whatever it is. Did you see it? Oh, yeah. Wait, here comes the surface, ready? Watch the big stingray. Big stingray, Michelle. Oh, jeez. Uh oh, good luck getting this thing off. That's a good sign. That's a We're gonna have to let go. Holy Christ, I just make the whole trip. That's a good monster. Yeah. Let's go to the base and cut yep. it off. Do I get that? Camera? Oh, it came off. Oh, it came off. Oh. Did you see it? Dang, though? a big stingray, though. Ooh. Wow. Crazy. Holy moly. Big stingray. All right, guys, just lost that monster sting right, right there. I'm hoping he's got some of it on GoPro. Just to, it's at least it was the it was a big sucker. Yep. It wasn't a small sting. It was a big what one. Is it? So, so I, I'm gonna I'm gonna say you know the fish stories where I say it's this big. As big as a trash can. Really. It was it was this wide, and it was and it was just hovering. And oh, I'm, yeah. I'm hoping he's got it on the GoPro. Yep, I, it spit right at the rocks. It's pulling drag too, man. That was super crazy. We got a big get back out there. It's a crazy day we're having so far. Dude, you know, we caught something out of Niagara. That was pumping my forearm like no one's business. Yep, man. And on, it was on the chop mullet too. Took it right off that hook. And I'd like to also thank Noah for yelling to me, fish, fish, because I wasn't paying attention. Yeah, he, was, he was looking at, down at his phone. You got fish, you got fish. <laughs> so, okay. All right, let's get back on. Thank you. Take it easy, guys. All right, guys, and that's going to end the episode for today. All in all, today was a pretty good day of fishing. Uh, we were actually here two days ago fishing both times but the weather was terrible had about 20 mile an hour winds and that's probably why we weren't catching any so today it was there was no wind at all five miles an hour so we decided to head out early in the morning and got some pretty good ones so that was a couple new species for us both right there and yeah all in all pretty good day uh hopefully we can make a couple more one or two more episodes for you i know colin's also in florida uh, he's more inland but so you'll probably see some exotic species pond hopping from him and i think he's going to the beach a couple times too so we'll see what fish he can catch for you and yeah see you guys in the next episode you got anything to say big man no oh, great day man great it day. was a marathon day and uh just amazing to see being a different body of water it's crazy dude how about like that it. big old stingray you hooked up to like i said i hope he's got some sort of a picture on his uh, gopro it was big oh yeah giant it was big it was a it was a nice fight too the biggest fight of anything i've ever had it was pretty <laughs> cool it was yeah, it's pulling drag on the what, we had like 30 pound leader that was crazy. yeah you started laughing man you <laughs> said hey look at that I, I, so, yeah yeah hopefully we could redeem ourselves and get one huge fish out of here we got a couple days left so see so we can pull out so See you guys in the next episode. Have a good one, guys. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna kill you. <laughs>